Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to the Thursday night live stream Search for Silver with me, Raven of Ravenhawk Coins. It's going to be a great night tonight, and uh, this is actually the second time we've gone live today. It's going to be a lot of fun. Wait for everybody to get the notice that we've uh, gone live. Budget Bullion Stacker, first in the house. What's going on, Budget? Oops, how you doing today? All right, there goes the robot. We're good to go. Majestic Sounds of Coins. What's going on, Majestic? And Currency Systems, what's new? Mick Greedy in the house. Coin, <laughs> Coin Hunter Chris says he's gone live. Colorado Coin Hunting, Savvy Stacker, Quezon 2006, Canadian Ryan, Slightly Unleashed is in the house. Bill, King of the LTD, Gibson, version 6.9, with his brother, J Dog. Oh, you better call somebody in the house. Coin Silver is here as well as Cody Amons. Howdy, howdy, brother, and the rest of the fam. So we're going to get this started with an early bird giveaway. Matter of fact, we're starting off with a really nice silver 2007 S. Uh, Bub's delicious. I actually have uh, seven spots left. I have 43 rolls in total. Uh, we're going to give away a 2007 S proof quarter. Tape Master, how you doing? Chris Neb, Michael Coretta, Ty Hitman, Bub's delicious. Good to see you, Bub's. Golden Silverman is here as well. Coin Silver, AG47 Recon, Shannon Smith. Daniel Dombrosio, along with G-Dub. What's going on, G-Dub? How you doing tonight? All right, so you're going to get a Silver Proof Quarter as the Early Bird Giveaway. We're giving away a Ravenhawk Coins, couple stickers there. Dr. Dazed in the house. What's going on, Dr. Dazed? Tony Woods, Empyrean Label. My brother from another mother, good to see you, good to see you. Uh, Robert Worley is here as one hard-working mod right there with a blue wrench, Mr. Robert Worley, the man, the myth, the legend. Bubs Alicious says, just please check PayPal. Will do. Give me just one second, Bubs. Alrighty, guys. Guys, we got a... Hundred dollar spot from the one, the only Bubs Alicious. Thank you, Bubs. I appreciate that. All right, so number seven, Bubs. And that's 14 rolls. My math is horrible. Give me one second so I can tell you guys where we're at. Uh, 43. Three. All right, so that leaves a total of 29 rolls. That's really actually three spots left, guys. Three $50 spots um, if you're trying to get in. And thank you very, very much. Bub's Delicious, that's awesome. Uh, let's see here. Papa Giorgio is in the house. Good to see you. Jaji Music Man Coins is here. I like the name change, Jaji. That's cool. Um, so let me get the... Hey, Scott Jarvie. What's going on, brother? Let me get this early bird giveaway started. And then we will get uh, we'll get rolling here in just one sec. So we're going to get to the giveaway. Reset that. And remember, uh, this is for a 2007 S Proof Quarter. And that's a silver quarter. And stickers. Absolutely free. And we're going to put about six minutes on that bad boy. And uh, get that started right now. Matter of fact, oops, we're not sold out. We're looking for the bot. There it is. And before we get this party started, a little luck with some... Suzuki! <laughs> All righty. So good luck to everybody in the giveaway, and um, 
and get back over on the screen so I'm not missing anybody. But uh, Vern LaPointe in the house. Uh, Colorado Coin Hunting says to check PayPal. Okay, brother, I will give that a shot. Give me just one second. I'll go back to PayPal. Alrighty, so we have, I believe this is from Colorado Coin Hunting, a $50 spot. Thank you very much, my friend. I appreciate that. Is that seven rolls? And then we have one more, it looks like, from Bub's Delicious. So give me just a second to go back and double check to make sure. Yes, we do. Ladies and gentlemen, another spot. $50 from the one and only Bub's Delicious. All right, so that leaves two spots on the evening open. If you're trying to get in, there are two spots left. And thank you very, very much, Colorado Coin Hunting and uh, Bub's Delicious. I really do appreciate it, guys. You guys are awesome. Good to see Brian Smouse is here, Draco's Dragon, A Better World, Shark Bait Lucky, Sergeant Stacker, the man, the myth. D. Wayne Mansell is here. Toto D. Toto D. Wolfie Oland. Uh, D. A. Sales. How you doing, D. A.? Good to see you. And Hey Zeus is in the casa. I like that name. Hey Zeus. Matt D. The madman making the awesome chainmail jewelry and stuff. Uh, Brian Smouse. I think I already said he's in the house, but hey. I like I like saying the smousinators here. So, all right, guys, the first person up tonight is uh Matt B. Shark Bay Lucky. Two spots, meaning I can donate for seven rolls now. Uh, Shark Bay, if you wanted to be in for seven rolls, yes, you could. There's there's two seven roll spots left. So two $50 spots. And uh, Matt D can't stay. He's at work, brother. Oh, man. Well, at least we'll see you in the near future, hopefully. And uh, you know what? I forgot to ask Miss Raven if we have a... Uh, what people wanted for their their choices. Alrighty. And guys, a huge birthday shout out to the one and only Kevin Nolan. Ladies and gentlemen, it's a very cool thing. And uh, Archaeology Mikey had, a, had grilled cheeseburgers again and fries. Uh-oh. Prepping for college programs. Look out. <laughs> nice. All right, Chris Nav, Wolfie Olin, congrats on the Rob Finds Treasure giveaway win. Nice. That's always cool when you get a giveaway win. Brass Junkie, my brother, I still have your video coming out soon. It was supposed to be, I was going to do a, a mail call with this morning's uh, preview, and I totally spaced out on that. I apologize for that. Deborah Wall's in the house, and uh, but very, very cool. So that was a gift from uh, Kevin's daughter to him. And so a big shout out. When we get to his, we'll we'll do a little uh we'll do a little singing. And uh so if Matt B is in, in the house and wants to let me know which uh rounds he would like or coins I should say, you can have either yourself a silver eagle and a kookaburra, or you can pick from the Star Wars stuff. Right now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna give him a silver eagle and a kookaburra. And if he tells me differently, I will change it. I'm going to make sure that I email some people. Um, Aaron Brenneman is up second. Chris Nab up third. Uh, Kevin Nolan's fourth. Chief Stackers fifth. S. Lazinski sixth. Bubs Delicious seven. Colorado Coins is eight. Bubs Delicious is nine. And uh, all right, I will check it out. Sharp Big Lucky, give me one second here. 
We'll get into that. Matter of fact, we should be able to pull for the winner on the early bird giveaway here in just a second, too. So just one second. I'm, I'm kind of lagging today, guys, I know. And I apologize, but we'll get we'll get right on this. All right, guys. Shark bait lucky. Shark bait. Ooh ha ha. <laughs> Shark bait lucky. First time donator, ladies and gentlemen. That leaves one spot, guys. All righty. Thank you very much, Shark bait. I appreciate that, my friend. All righty. And. Uh, all right, so there's one $50 spot left on the evening, and uh, let's see who won. Uh, Cody, it's good to see you, man. I hope you have a good evening. All right, guys, yes, it's time to pick the winner. Three, two, one, boom! Currency Systems. Ladies and gentlemen, that is a first-time win for Currency Systems. They're getting themselves the 2007S quarter of Miss Raven sticker, a couple Ravenhawk stickers, and uh, congratulations to Currency Systems. Thank you for coming and hanging out. You're the winner of the early bird. All right, so Currency Systems, and we're going to get started on the hunt, guys. I am... Uh, Icerk says, I will be watching all that I can. Thank you, my brother. Good to see Michael Coretta. Deborah Walls is here. S. Lazinski's in the house. Good to see you. Canadian Ryan, my brother from another mother. Silver Sith. Jesse O. Aiden Gallegos. Chris Smith. Good to see everybody. Hope you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful day. And staying safe, you know. Let's get let's get the first box and this is for Matt B. Oops. Oh man, that's heavy. Alrighty, Mark B. What's going on? Hey Zeus says I'll take the last spot. All right, I'll write you down, Hey Zeus. All right, so he's number eleven and that is Hey Z U E S. Right? Oh, Z E U S. All right, so hey, Zeus, 57 rolls. Guys, you know what that means? That means we are officially sold out. Look out. Boop, 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 boop. <laughs> All right, so this first one is for Matt. We're going to get the box open here. I'll show you that it is a sealed box. I have no idea what's in here. And uh, that... Hey, Peter Bose. Hey, Peter, I have a, 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 a package from you. And i um, really happy. Thank you for that, by the way. That'll be opened here before long. But I did get something from Peter. Wanted to let him know. And uh, this right here that you see, K4, that's in honor of my brother, um, the, the Colonel 1949 that passed. Um, give me one second, guys. I'm going to check PayPal here. Um, give me one sec, because... Uh-oh. Uh All right, guys, so... Hey Zeus, got the last spot, and looks like I'm actually oversold by the one spot here, and um, that is coming from Brass Junkie. Brass Junkie, my brother, I'm sorry you just missed it. Do you want me to to uh, refund you, or do you want me to hold on to it for for Sunday, my brother? Hey, Raven, I forgot you have your own time zone now. <laughs> what do you mean? Just W says I have my own time zone. Did I do something strange? All right. 
<laughs> let's get into the search. All right, so so for Matt, I'm gonna give him these two right now to start. If he changes it in uh, when I email him, that's fine. Sunday is okay for Brass Junkie. Thank you, brother. And Brass Junkie, like I said, your stuff, um, I still have it in the box. I was literally going to add it to the preview this morning, and I totally forgot. 8, 10, 12, 14 rolls. They get two pulls. Mr. Nilbar, how you doing? Good to see you. Good to see Aiden Gallegos and Jesse O. All right, so we got a 1967... 40 percenter it's a bu and then the uh slabbed quarter nice all right so so we got the 67 bu and the slabbed quarter to go with the two ounces of silver for mr matt majestic did you ever go back and look at 130 for sure a majestic no i didn't get a chance bro um i was doing other stuff and I saw what you wrote. That's a freaking amazing thing that you found, bro. And I'm really stoked for you. My 6 p.m. is somehow 3.47 Pacific time. <laughs> uh, that's funny. Michelle Ibarola. How you doing, Michelle? Good to see you. Robert saves history is here as well, and um, but yeah, guys, under the scope is in memory of my brother K4 Paula Bloom. What's going on? It's the Bluminator. Josh Schultz says hello, everyone. Got in a little late. Michael Hargis, what's going on, Mike? Good to see you, bro. All righty. Good to see Josh. Good to see Paula. Chris Nab. Canadian Ryan. All the good people here. And I'm I'm gonna just have to end up making a really big mail opening video. Um, hopefully the silver gavels will get here tomorrow. It was supposed to be here today. And um, somehow it got delayed, and that's not of anybody's fault other than the postal service. They have been really dropping the ball lately. But, you know, it kind of, we kind of got to be a little bit understanding too because, you know, the volume of shipping during this time goes way up. But what, what do you do, you know? It's just frustrating, is all. So we're really hoping we find some silver tonight. We got the Bill Gibson bounty coin still in effect. We want. A walking lib in the box and guys I saw something really crazy the other day I'm not gonna say where it was from but I saw somebody showed me a picture of a half dollar box and it said on the outside of the box that the box had no silver and it was pre-sorted hi Peggy Smiths how are you doing Ravenhawk there's Stuff coming from Atmex for Christmas giveaways from Canadian Ryan. Look out, guys. Canadian Ryan always gives really cool stuff during the Christmas time. Colorado coin hunting. Definitely hope uh, Colorado is doing better after the surgery. That is for sure. Uh, Peggy Smith's to do relics. It's exclamation mark relics. And uh, here, I will reward the chat with some relics so that you have something to play with. Give me one second here. What up, Gringo? Good to see Gringo OG22. Uh, all right, guys. And for all of you that do not know about it, Paula Bloom is in the house. And Paula Bloom is the host of The Big Show, which is every, every I think it's every two weeks, the show comes on. They have great giveaways, and also she is part of the Coin Q&A. That is a panel of people that help you figure out what kind of coins do you have in your possession. 
you know, are they worth anything? Are they they specific kind of errors and whatnot? Guys, we have our first find. It's pretty beat up, so I'll replace it with a different one. But we got an NIFC. And, uh, but yeah, Chief Stacker's in the house. What's up, Chief? Um, check out Paula Bloom's channels, guys. Really cool stuff. And, um, you know, you can learn quite a bit from the panel. And also, the big show is another thing that she does where people send in stuff and make, I mean, I'm telling you, the giveaways on that are insane, guys. They make my, my giveaways look kind of small. And you know how I am. <laughs> um, then up next, also, guys, she's not here right now. She is on vacation. But it is Ida Herring is having the Cancer Quilt fundraiser. And if you do uh, any type of content or you have your own channel sticker and you want to be part of the community cancer quilt you send in your stickers to ida and make sure to please send in oh paula bloom you're more than welcome my friend i wanted to be able to help um i sent in some stuff to paula and because i i believe in these these things that are going on guys um, you know, there's Paula, there's Ida, there's also, I'm a sponsor for Redneck Metals. So, you know, there's a lot going on. But for um, Ida, she's doing the cancer quilt. And like I said, if you have a sticker for your channel, you send in a stick, two stickers and a quarter, or not a quarter, you send in a 90% piece of silver, 40% or whatever you have to be a part of also this a sticker box. Hey, James Eller, the lucky one. The lucky James Eller. I know, Colorado took went on vacation without us, right? So, there's also a sticker box that's involved. That's why you send in two stickers, one for the quilt and one for the box. So far, the sticker box has something to the tune of 170-something items, guys. And that's going to be auctioned off and given to the Susan G. Komen Foundation and for the uh, fight against cancer and it's going to be really really awesome the quilt's going to be gorgeous and you just never know what's going to be added to that what's up train watcher don you know you never know what's going to be added to that mix uh, because there's still a little bit of, there's still a couple months before the actual auction and like i said people have sent in a lot of stuff and I wouldn't be uh, promoting it if I didn't believe in it. Diggin' Dave. What's going on, Dave? You changed your icon. It, it just used to be your face. I hope we get some silver tonight, Chris Nab. Um, but guys, I'm telling you, I saw a picture where they, they, they had gotten a box from somewhere. And it said that it, there was no silver on the box. I haven't seen a follow-up to it. But I'm curious as to, you know, how, how many places really have that. I've only seen, ever seen it the one time. Maybe somebody did it as a joke. Maybe it's true. But I don't know. When you do my rolls, you don't have to send me your stickers. I have a few already. <laughs> no problem, man. Empyrean l -l 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 label. What up, Empyrean? 1993 NIFC. I don't know about any 93 NIFC. J Dog. Canada, eh? <laughs> All right. Yeah, I finally made a logo. <laughs> Let's see here. I don't know. I'm I'm missing something. But guys, under the scope is actually Oh, wait a second. I it messed up my eyes. I thought I was looking at a 2003 and that's a 93. Ha. That's funny. So we didn't have any fines. You know what, guys? I made a bonehead mistake, so I didn't announce what the end of stream is, and the end of stream is actually going to be this Boba Fett. 
I'm going to throw in a 1956 Philly 90% quarter in the mix. That's too funny, guys. I literally thought that said 2003. <laughs> All right, so no find. Rant, rant. Matter of fact, where is... Oh, guys, I had something that was perfect for times like this, and now it's, now it's of course, not to be found. Oh, man. <laughs> this is... Come on. Oh, here it is. I messed up, so which one is it? It's the... <laughs> All right. If you get boxes in Canada with ARP stamped on it, no silver or coins older than 1999. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. The Elusive 93. Robert Worley says, Oh, my God, I need the industry in Boba Fett. That thing was so dirty, dirty that I saw the three, and I'm like, okay, it looks like 2003. It's just super dirty, so I'll replace it myself. <laughs> Shane Kennedy Cancer sucks. Just had skin cancer taken on my face and they had to remove half of my chin. Wow, Shane. I am sorry to hear that, brother. See, guys? That shows you, man. You know, cancer... I don't know anybody that um, hasn't been affected one way or another by cancer, guys. You know, they have a friend or a loved one that's suffered from, you know, either recovered or passed on. And cancer is horrible, you know. But uh, speaking of Rob Finds Treasure, guys, there's going to be every two weeks a three-person panel. And then we're going to have a guest. It's myself, Silver Seeker, and Rob Finds Treasure. And uh, yeah, we're going to have a lot of fun with that. Our first one was just the other day. The next one's going to be on the 28th. It's going to be a lot of fun. Oh, my God. What's that smell? Okay, who let him out? The moose is loose. Moose 2K20. Bill's coins and treasure. What's going on, brother? You're, it's all good, man. Good to have you here, you know? Hopefully, everybody's good. Tape Master lost mother to cancer when they were 12. Wow. I am very sorry for your loss, my friend. That is horrible. Lost my best pal to cancer in 2020. She's only 54. Man, Savvy Stacker, that is... That's rough. 2020 has been a hard year, guys. A hard year. I, I've i seen... Um, I know some people that have moved away to try to start a new life in a different state. And, you know, they're back here because things... There got really bad and jobs and stuff just that they had gone there and started a new life with are just all gone. Yes, Wolfie Olin, that is where you get to dog on Seeker about him not having a beard compared to me and Rob. You never know. Maybe one day we'll be uh, tempted to see if we can get a beard off of me or Rob. You just never know. Plumber Stacker says, what's up, y'all? Hey, Plumber, how you doing, man? Welcome to the show. And thanks for being a part of the Raven Nation, my friend. I really do appreciate your recent uh, membership. It was really cool of you. Cannot thank everybody enough that supports the channel because you guys are awesome. And uh, so we're going to get this together for him in a little bit bigger bag to go. Boom. Pro Slice 56. What's up, brother? He says, I just got my screens back and I'm officially cancer free for a year. Woo! Congratulations to Pro Slice, guys. Cancer free for a year, man. You know what? That is, that's freaking awesome, dude. Matter of fact, hold on. Give me a second here, guys. I am going to, uh, I'm going to find something real quick. Give me one sec. I know you guys can still hear me, but I want to want to add something to the mix. Um I 
I'm sorry guys, I know what. All right, guys, so in celebration of Pro Slice 56 having a year cancer-free, that is very, very cool. I'm going to add this bag of wheats that was sent to me. I do not know what's in here at all, but this is a bag. It's supposed to be Wheaties. I think there might be a 59 or two in there because I can see a 59, but the majority of these, of these are Wheaties. So I'm going to add that to the end of stream. I don't even know how many is in there. That was part of a grab bag. And then um, we're going to do this. A 1963 Benji. That's going to go to the end as well. So we're going to add that. So we got a, a quarter, a Benji, a bag of wheats, and a Boba Fett for the end of stream. Because I love hearing news like that. You know, Pro Slice, congratulations, bro. I hope it stays like that for a long time. Even Miss Raven's giving the thumbs up as she walks through and grabs food and stuff. All right, guys, up next is my brother Aaron Brenneman. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve. 14 rolls for Aaron Brenneman. Aaron, let me know what you would like uh, for your silver. You can have either ASE and Kookaburras or any one of the Star Wars, but this is for Aaron Brenneman. We got two pulls. We got the 1969 mint set and a quarter. All right, so we're gonna grab a quarter here. Put that there. <laughs> Wolfie says, I see my name on the weedy bag. <laughs> All right, guys. And a 69 mint set going to Aaron. So very, very cool. Make sure everything's in there. Yep. All right. And uh, Aaron says, Darth. All right. I will get you Darth. Let's see here. That's a stormtrooper. All right, cool. Uh, Savvy Stacker Currency Systems won when the beginning of the stream giveaway. Thanks for asking. So I got a Darth there. I'm gonna get you an extra one here. Uh, Gringo, that is in honor of the Colonel 1949, my, my buddy that passed away. I, uh, I just wanted to put something there, kind of remind us of him, if, if you guys didn't know who he was or whatnot. He was a really, really sweet man, really cool friend. I uh, did, did a lot of stuff, some trades and whatnot, and, you know, just a good guy, and I really miss him, um. You know, but thanks for asking. All right, so let's get into it, guys. Next up, up. Come on, let's see some silver in here. We want to walk and live. That's what we really want. And guys, I made a super bonehead maneuver um, today on the stream. I was like, hey, these are sealed uh, mint sets. Come to find out, mint sets are. Uh, not sealed they're sealed by the person that bought them so i felt kind of dumb with that <laughs> cm silver what up cm silver in the house cm the man the myth the legend the biggest donator to this channel lifetime is the one and only cm mustang dave what's going on brother Sorry about your and his family loss. 2020 has been rough. Yeah, Gringo, it really has, man. It really, really has. But hopefully it gets better, you know? No, I did not lick the envelopes, Papa Giorgio. <laughs> I stay away from uh, the glue. I don't, want, I don't want that on my tongue. Ugh. You don't know where it's been. It's old. No, I'm just kidding. But, uh, yeah... 
you know what's up Tommy's channel how you doing my friend hope you're having a good day what else is going on there's some other stuff going on I as a matter of fact I'm gonna be doing a huge mail call hey guys I'm telling you rolls give give us some a lot of silver please um, curious would did you guys want a live mail call or just open it and do a video been the toughest year of Cody's life and that's without the flu wow man the glue is icky tasting yes <laughs> yes it is you would think they'd come up with something like bubble gum or peach or cherry or you know something to make it taste good worth your while but um but yeah, so I'm curious if what you guys think, I because I, for the most part, mail calls really aren't that popular, you know. Hey, please make sure that all the the uh, discussion is family friendly in here, guys. You know, please, no politics, no religion. Um, you know, and don't pick on anybody. That, that goes for the mods as well. You can't pick on other mods. <laughs> as much as I love all of you, you know, make sure that you stay positive and support each other. Because that's really what I care about the most, guys. Is that we all know, you know, how to, to get along. <laughs> Stacking... What's up, Stormy? He says, if they made cherry flavor envelopes, I'd go to Staples and open the boxes and just start licking them. Well, you know, we, we all have our favorite stuff to do. Chuck them on the ground when I'm done. <laughs> yeah, I'm done with you, cherry flavored envelope. That was delicious. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, stacking Stormtrooper. Um... If you got, we should talk. I I I, I want to talk to you about a couple things. Um, <laughs> budget bullion. I'd rather have acid on mine. That's funny. Stacking storm Reaver might do it regardless, but Stormy, uh, email me, man, because I don't know your email. But email me. Let's. I, I might have an email from you actually. But we we should have a little chat on. Um, on like a stream yard or something, you know? There's just a couple things that they want to bounce off you. How many of you in this chat are the peppermint paste from Gar... Oh, no, I did not eat peppermint paste. Uh-uh. Never, ever did I try, try paste or glues when I was a kid. I ate some crowns, though. My mom said that was funny that I had rainbow-colored poo. <laughs> But, uh, yeah. Good stuff. You know, it's always good when people get along, you know. Yeah, Stag and Stormtree. We will. I, I think I have your email, I think, from a while back. And, um, do you have Streamlabs? I mean, I guess we could talk on Hangouts. But, uh,. But definitely, definitely got a couple things that I want to talk to you about a little bit. And then maybe, possibly, if it works out, do some kind of a collab. I don't know. Um, but we'll see. You know? You got it. Tone Coins Rock. Guys, matter of fact, um, just paid for a Zoom account. Huh. I don't have Zoom. We'll figure something out, man. There, with all this technology, there's a way. <laughs> Chief Stacker always cuts his tongue when he licks the, the, the envelopes. Hey, uh, Chief Stacker. Oh, cool. You got the Streamlabs set up, too. Cool. Oh, Toner Poo. Ha, <laughs> ha. Rainbow tone, that's funny. I was I was I was looking for tone stuff as a kid. All right, you guys are you guys are gross. 
Oh my goodness. I swear. I can I can dress you guys up, but I can't take you anywhere. What the heck? It's a family show. <laughs> oh man. I guys I seriously, seriously love hanging out with you guys. You guys crack me up. You come up with some stuff. My mom said so, said Mustang Dave. <laughs> Thanks, Dave. <laughs> Dave's not here, man. LJ, austere privateer. What's going on, brother? Good to see ya. Yeah, and guys, so the midstream giveaway is going to be a 2005S silver proof quarter as well. We're going hardcore tonight with the silver giveaways. You can't go wrong, you know. Um, also, guys, make sure that you check out JW Coins and Hobby. You know, he's a good dude. Wow, very cool. JW found a binary $20 bill. Ah, sick. Ah, so, guys, so Bill Gibson um, sent me a, a thing. He said to explain what I saw. So, I saw a picture that said on the side of a box that it was stamped and it said literally pre-sorted no silver. Hey, Jeff Dunn, what's going on? And I haven't seen a follow-up to that yet. I'm, I'm curious as to was there really no silver in the box or not. Um, but, you know, I, I don't know yet. Uh, but but guys, I'm telling you, check out JW Coins and Hobbies. He's Wednesdays and Sundays, <coughs> along with my friend Big Mill. You guys already know Rob finds treasure. Seekers on Saturdays. Mario Cervantes. Ladies and gentlemen, it's Maria Cervantes, the woman, the myth, the female legend herself, Maria Cervantes. Como estas, Maria? Silver Cason, or Silver Wishes in the house. How you doing, Silver Wishes? JW Coins and Hobby rocking it, and uh... JW, make sure you put your link up, man. Uh, this is Aaron B. Right now, wait, this is. Yeah, this is Aaron. A. A. Ron. Stacking, thank you. Hey, uh, Miss Raven, I can hear you in the mic. I hope everything's okay back there with the little one. I. I hear one of the little ones crying. Start stacking Stormtrooper. Have a good one, bro. All right, so up next, guys, is Kevin Nolan. Kevin Nolan gets two, four, six, seven rolls. He gets a pull out of the Raven Relic bag. He's getting the 1968 Mint set. And I'm going to give him... You know what? I'm going to give him the Mandalorian. And if he wants something different, he's more than welcome to let me know. And I will change it for him. But we're going to do that. And we're going to give him the 1968 Mint Set to go along with that. And definitely big happy birthday to the one, the only, Kevin Nolan from his daughter, Megan. So happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Kevin Nolan. Happy birthday to you. <laughs> oh, darn it. I, I did skip Chris Nab. Oops. Okay. I, I skipped Chris, guys. So, you know what? These should be Chris's rolls. Um, I'm still going to... Oh, darn it. All right. Let's see what Chris gets. You know what, Chris? I'm bumping you up to the Benji because I gave you a quarter because I feel bad of 
taking you out of order there. And, uh, oh, it's not Matt B. It's Mark B. That was first, guys. I don't know why that was written down wrong. Mark B. was the first person tonight, guys. Oh, I'm telling you. I knew there was something fishy going on here. Hey, um, so what I'm going to do that I think is the fair thing is I'm actually going to take this because it's the set and put it back in there and see what happens. And then I'll redraw for Kevin Nolan and we'll go, we'll go that way because it is, is fair. Chris Nab wants an ASE. Cool. And thanks for being understanding. You guys rock. All right. So there's Chris Nabs. So we're going to do a, a draw for Chris. Oh, wait, we already did a draw for Chris. So it looks like he's going to get the 64. Oh, wow. Guys. Kevin Nolan got a, a bump up, I think, in my mind. He got a 1964 BU. Woohoo! All righty. So I'm going to put Kevin Nolan's to the side. We're doing Chris Nabs right now. And uh, fill the board. Maple Leaf Bigfoot Privy for 27 bucks. LJ, that is a smoking deal, dude. Um, the, the Bigfoot Privies are ex usually have a pretty high premium. Chris Ved Broughton, how you doing, Chris? Welcome to the show. Dove Seasons 91 says Red Raid from Redneck Stacker. Look out, I'm getting raided from the Red. <laughs> Yeah. Guys, definitely uh What's up, Phil the Board? The Ballad of Janine, Kaylee number one fan, Kaylee Ray, holy cow. I'm getting red rated, guys. Look out. If you guys don't know about redneck stacker then you just don't know what's going on rating from your mind red <laughs> kelly ray how you doing dove seasons 91 thanks for being here silver wishes says hey where's the crabs <laughs> you never know you never know oh ballad of janine has the crabs look out guys it's an international stacker trademark. With the historical significance of <clears throat> with the historical significance of the Oklahoma state of Oklahoma had in the days of the old west, have you ever tried metal detecting? Uh, Michael Hargis, I have not done any metal detecting in Oklahoma yet, but you know what? I would love to. I had a metal detector and it got broke in my move, and so I'm kind of bummed that that happened, to be honest, because I would like to do some metal detecting. It's just another um, item that I need to purchase, and I did, literally, I saw one that was on Craigslist that I was going to buy. I called the guy, and he said I missed it by like five minutes, um, so, you know, it's just another thing that I need to try to find a way to be able to do it, you know? <laughs> Wolfie doesn't want crabs. <laughs> Todd Miller, what's going on, brother? Larry Powell the second. What's up, Larry? How you doing, man? Good to see you. Good to see you. Matter of fact, all you guys that just came in on the raid, good thing you're here. We're about to do a midstream giveaway here in just a minute after this box is done. We will have a giveaway for the chat. It's going to be a 2005 S silver proof quarter along with some stickers and then the industry giveaway which is after the second box is a bag of wheats a benji a quarter and a bobo fett one ounce silver round or so that's actually a silver coin minted from newy absolutely free to you guys holy cow guys I found a guitar pick. Ha! <laughs> 
That is unreal. Check that out, guys. It's a flex tor it says tortex like a turtle. A turtle guitar pick. Capital currency. How you doing, my friend? So uh Chris Nab, do you want the guitar pick? I'll put it there for now. Yeah, Tortex. Uh, that is such a trip. I've now I've seen everything, guys. A freaking guitar pick in the rolls. <laughs> oh, that goes in the miscellaneous for sure. That is that is just what a trip. Uh, Budget Bullion says that's a decent pick. Um, so Chris Nab, let me know, man. Cimarron says, of course he does. I don't know what that means, but hey. <laughs> um, this would go through a machine because, well, look at If you look at the size of a half dollar, it just barely fits. Like, just barely. That is so weird. Chief Stacker's a guitar player. Nice. Chris says, sure, I'll add it to the collection. You know what, Chris? You can also tell people, hey, Michael Ellis, how you doing? That we we found that on a live stream at it, and that's just insane, man. I've seen a lot of stuff in boxes for like separating things, but I never, in my wildest dreams, imagined we'd find a guitar pick. But that is cool. All right, so we're gonna get this all in here for Chris. Chris, brother, thank you very much for being understanding, and I apologize for skipping on you. Is not on purpose, that's for sure. Thirty years. <laughs> Dumping in coin star to make money, that's funny. I found a guitar pick in a while back, says Deborah Walls. Oh, okay, cool. So I'm not the first one. But either way, that is pretty cool stuff. And I saw somebody said they've been playing guitar for a long time. And now I'm missing it. Oh, well. All right. I'm going to put that at the end. All right. Chris Nab. Okay, so next is Kevin Nolan. We already know that he got the BU Kennedy and the Mando. Two, four, six seven rolls if this box here doesn't give us anything uh colorado coin hunting's been playing it 30 years nice um if this box doesn't produce guys i will add something to the end of stream as well because you know we don't like skunk boxes at all um guys make sure like i said earlier if you do not know about it sundays after my show jw coins and hobby does a live pouring uh, event. Last week he did a box battle. Um, but oh wait, I'm not sure if he's he's streaming uh, or doing that. Uh, the the pours. I think he's streaming, but I'm not sure exactly what's going on. Um, oh Saturdays too, he does a a mail call with Big Mill usually. So keep your eyes out, you know. Cody Amons plays rhythm and bass. Nice. Capital Currency guitar for over 20 years. We need a band. Guys, a foot for silver. Thank you, brother. JW Coins and Hobbies going on vacation. Nice. I got a... Uh-oh, hey. Is this something good? Please, please. Oh, it's a 72. Bummer. Um, I got an invitation... To go fishing down in Florida with Chief Stacker. Christopher Sherman, oh hi. My PR70 DCAM 75 ASE should be arriving from PCGS in the next day or two, finally. Bro, that is awesome, man. Congratulations on getting one of those. I am very, 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 very bad at the, uh, the U.S. Mint. I really, really don't like them. <laughs> Susie Q can play rhythm and a little bass. Nice. Papa play bass. Mama sang tenor. <laughs> Here's another one of those pointed, uh, point, painted coins, guys. 
The story on these is pretty cool. Uh, waitresses would paint their half dollars or quarters or whatnot red so that they could get them back when the vendors came in and emptied out their coins. And it also let the vendors know that, hey, you know, the waitresses are pushing my items, which is pretty cool. Uh, have a full studio in my basement. Guitars, drums, bass, keys, full DJ setup. Capital Currency, where do you live? <laughs> uh, Christopher Sherman, yeah. Clown show for sure that day. Paula, Paula Bloom can play a mean kazoo. <laughs> Wolfie, because I went out of order, I put it back in and I redrew and this is his pull. He got a 1964 BU Kennedy... Plus his Mandalorian. Rose Dragon. What's going on, Rose? How you doing? But thank you for asking, Wolfie. I appreciate it. For the jukebox of the bar, knew which ones that came from their customers. Yep. That's also a good good point, Brass Junkie. Thank you, brother. But I, I think that's one of the coolest things, you know, that, that they were doing that to figure those things out and... Five string bass says Cujo eight zero six seven six. Nice. Oh, capital currency. I used to live in California, Maryland, bro. I lived right there at the bridge uh, that went across um, the HUD, the the Chesapeake, and I can't remember anything right off the bat. I was only there for a couple, like six months. Des logic, what's going on? I said Kennedy, J Dog. <laughs> yeah, Chris, a lot of people gave up, that's for sure. Um, oh man, I'm knocking stuff over. Ouch. But but yeah, I lived in California, Maryland, bro. I uh, I would have been like an hour and a half away from you, I think, Southern Maryland. I had my own little dock. You could walk out to the end and throw a chicken piece of chicken on a string, and next thing in you know, 20, 30 seconds, you'd have yourself crab. Yeah, capital it is it is a bummer. I'm not around. That would have been that would have been really cool. Big Mill, what up, Big Mill? Guys, don't forget to check out Big Mill. He's a good dude. And guys, because it's Kevin's birthday, I'm going to actually throw him in a silver quarter for free from 1941. It's a Philly, but that's for Kevin for his birthday. And uh, very cool. Guys, we got 93 likes already. Nice. That's awesome. All right, so we're almost done with this box. And like I said, if the box doesn't produce, we're going to add something to the midstream for that. And again, Kevin Nolan, happy birthday, brother. Thank you very much to uh, Megan. All right, guys, Chief Stacker, two, four, six, seven. Hey, Chief. Yeah, the Maryland Brew Club crabs are they're, they're the best in Maryland, that's for sure. Uh, Chief Stacker, let me know which silver round, uh, silver coin you wanted, brother. You got Silver Eagle, Kookaburra, or one of the Star Wars ones. It's your choice. And it's the 1968 mint set going to Chief Stacker. So I'm going to put that right there. get rocking but yeah so that we're up right now we're doing chief stackers rolls after chief stacker we're gonna do the midstream giveaway boom says j dog a hundred likes <coughs> nice thank you very very much everybody that in itself is a cool little benchmark to reach i hear miss raven whining oh peppa's peppa's beating her up look out guys 
Ms. Raven says she's half my size. Uh, I've been midden. <laughs> um, what was I saying? Oh well. So good to see Big Mill here, my bro, him and JW. Uh, matter of fact, what what else? There was something I was gonna tell you guys. Zeus, hey Zeus, my kids love Peppa. The pig, and yeah, they named the dog Peppa. Breeze for me. How you doing, Breezy? Good to see you. And Chief, I'm waiting. I don't see what he said. Ida Herring. What up, Ida? How you doing? Guys, Ida Herring here on her vacation time. Holy smokes. If you guys didn't already hear about the Ida Herring cancer fundraiser, let me know. I think that Peppa just likes to make her an appearance on every camera on Thursday and Sunday streams. Yes. Soon to be Peppa the horse, says CM. Yeah, she's getting big, guys. And it's kind of crazy almost overnight, you know? Uh, I'm doing very good, Ida. Doing very good. Um, he said, Silver Eagle. Thank you, guys. Awesome. All right, so Chief Stacker getting a Silver Eagle to go with his mint set. And uh, we got 103 likes, so we're going to add something to the end of stream. Guys, I love this place. Greg Lee, what's going on, Greg Lee? So, yes, guys, make sure I see it right there. Chief Stacker says ASE, please. And, guys, so I'm going to explain it one more time. The Ida Herring Cancer Quilt Extravaganza. Make sure you contact Ida. <laughs> Peppa dragging me down the street. Ah! Help! Yep. Matter of fact. Oh, she's coming back in the house. It's Peppa the Wonder Puppy. Oh, wait. She's making her way over here, it sounds like. All right, guys. Hold on. Here, hi, Peppa. Hi, oh my goodness, you're, oh god, you're huge. All right. Alrighty, oops. She's causing havoc. <laughs> Can you get that? All right, so this is, this is Peppa, this is her paws. Look at the size of that, these feet for a little puppy, guys. Let me see if I can get her to, there we go. She's saying, ow, you don't gotta, you don't gotta bite my nose. You don't gotta bite my nose. No, you don't. All right, go on. Go play. <coughs> that was Peppa. Whew. Hey. Do, do. All right. Special appearance time. <laughs> yeah, Peppa the Wonder Puppy. Matter of fact, we're going to make stickers for Peppa here in the near future. And uh, thank you, guys. She, Peppa came to us actually because there is a... Two dogs that were part of a neighbor's, um, you know, family. They had puppies, but they weren't taking care of them. And the adult dog showed up here like that and brought the puppy with. Uh, Cujo, it is a mixed dog. I, it is definitely part pit bull. Definitely part. <laughs> Michael says, Penny dog, what you doing in, in Raven Hood's? Ravenhawk's neighborhood. No, nah, she has not grown into those paws yet. And she also has that awkward walk that uh, big dogs have. And she leans up on you. So she's going to be pretty big. You know. 47420 says, Hey, yo. What's going on, bro? All right. So this is Chief Stacker. Let's get him a bag. Fit in there? Yes. She was a gift from God, says Wolfie. And Peppa's mom and knew that we'd take care of him. Yeah. Hey, Silver Streak, no problem. We got we got you covered, my friend. Eric MC. <laughs> JW says, I have an awkward walk for a big dude too, I understand. <laughs> But yeah, she's she's got that 
that it's hard to explain, but if you guys have raised dogs, and especially big dogs, the puppies seem to carry themselves a certain way. All right, so this is Chief Stacker. Thank you very much, Chief. I appreciate you, brother. All right, guys, so before I forget, I need to add something to the end of stream, and that is another silver quarter, and then we're adding a silver quarter to the midstream as well for the skunk box. So for the 100 likes, we added a quarter. Thank you guys so much. I do appreciate it big time we're going to give you some stickers proof quarter and a silver quarter that is the midstream giveaway courtesy of raven hot coins brass junkie cat man do is what up cat man do all right let's go here so we're gonna reset and this is midstream And we're going to make it five minutes, guys. Good luck to everybody. And I will reward the chat as well. If you are new to chat, it only takes 25 relics to enter a giveaway. And that's the maximum number. That's the only number that anybody can get. So all the giveaways are as fair as they can possibly be for everybody. And uh, Mateo Sternato, good to see you, man. Rockzilla's in the house. Good to see Rockzilla. Little Penny Coins, 999. Mark B. Fubar. McGreedy. Caribbean Coins, man. Peter Bowes. And, of course, Ida Herring. Um, so, guys, so the Ida Herring quilt, cancer quilt thing, you send in a, two stickers, one for the cancer quilt and one for the sticker box. And then if you send in a 90% uh, silver there's a, a sticker box auction that's going to go with that. It's going to be really, really cool. So what I'm going to do real quick while we have the giveaway going, guys, I'm going to run and use the, the facilities. I'll be right back. Please stay tuned. Raven Hot Coins, stay tuned. Guys, ladies and gentlemen, Capital Currency with a $2 super sticker with a big thumbs up. Thank you, Capital Currency, brother. I appreciate the love. And uh, that helps us give away more stuff. You know how we do it. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me, guys. Okay, so we're getting into the next box. Uh, let me grab that. Wow. Alrighty. Thank you, J-Dog. Whew. So here we go. Crack this. Oh, wait. You know what? I forgot to show you guys before I crack it open that it is sealed. 
I busted it a little bit there, but let's do it. Bub's delicious in the house. All right, let's. All right, so S. Lazinski is up next. Lazinski gets two, four, six, seven rolls. A pull out of the relic bag. Big Mill, the maximum entries is 25, Big Mill. And it is the 1969 mint set. And uh, for S. Lazinski, I need to know which you, what you would like for your silver. If you want a silver eagle, kookaburra, or whatnot. And, uh, oh yeah, there's my washed hands. <laughs> Come on, Mill. Get it together. Who's the captain of this dinghy, Big Mill? <laughs> All righty. Native Warrior, what's going on? And uh, very cool. Empyrean, says Ida. Good to see everybody hanging out. Hope you're having a good evening tonight. You guys are staying nice and warm where it's cold. And nice and cool where it's too warm. And I'm looking for S. Lazinski to say what they would like to have. Catfish Arg. What's up, Catfish? Good to see you. Good to see Catfish in the house. He's a good dude. Cody Amons is here. Tommy's channels. When are you going to pick the winner, Tommy, uh, in a second? I think it. there was a five-minute timer on it. Okay, we're ready to pick that person in three, two, one. Boom! Ha! <laughs> Caribbean coins with the win. Look, look at that. It's been a while for Caribbean. So Caribbean got himself. And thank you very much, Josh Voss, with a $5 super chat found in... Found you rocking with RFT Monday and became a subscriber. That is too cool, man. Let me make sure I, I read this properly. Glad to be subscribed. Love the channel, bro. Thank you, bro. I appreciate that, Josh. Big shout out to Josh Voss with the $5 super chat. So Caribbean coins, you're the winner. Winner, winner, Caribbean dinner. Look out. <laughs> All righty, so let me, uh, let me write his name here. And yeah, guys, speaking of seeing us on Monday, that show is going to be every two weeks. It's going to be a lot of fun. And uh, I believe Big Mill is our next uh, our next uh, guest. But I'm not sure. You just never know. <laughs> I'm going to give S. Lazinski a uh, Silver Eagle for now. I haven't seen what they said that they wanted. But... If they want to change their mind, I don't have a problem changing that for them at all. But congratulations to Caribbean Coins. Good job. <laughs> oh, Big Mill. I did a, a half of a face a reveal. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, I forgot. Big Mill with the face reveal. That is the thing with uh, being on our panel. You, you you show your mug. Well, at least most of it. I, I went on there still with my sunglasses and stuff on, you know. Can I take down the bot? Yeah. Give me just a sec. Down with you, bot. There you go. All right. You know what? Let's let's do a little... David. Hoping that gets us something, but you know, usually we know what we came here for. Hey, Archaeology Mikey, have a good one, man. <laughs> it's still hard to believe that that's actually my voice doing that. <laughs> that thing, that that that's rough on the throat, you know. Susie Q dropped a uploaded a metal detecting video today. Nice, Susie. 
Susie Q, I'm gonna have to give you some view time in the very near future, hon. Um, I do, I do owe you some. Yeah, guys, it is gonna be a big mill face reveal during the RFT Ravenhawk Coins and Seeker panel interview show, whatever you want to call it. It's gonna be very cool. Big Mill's a good dude. Good dude. <coughs> but if um, anybody knows a good deal for a metal detector, let me know. Because I would love to do some metal detecting here in Oklahoma. Um, you know, it looks like I'm going to be living here a little bit longer than I thought I would. So I might as well enjoy myself more once uh, once this COVID gets in better check, you know. Even with your face reveal, your identity is still a mystery to the folks who didn't know that Clark Kent was Superman. <laughs> Thank you, Brass Junkie. You guys' show was awesome. Keep it up. Thank you, Josh. Yeah, it's going to be really, really cool, too, and it's going to rotate. So Big Mill will do the be the next person, and then two weeks after that, we'll do somebody on Silver Seeker's channel, and then another two weeks after that, it'll be Silver Seeker's channel, and then it'll be my channel. Um, so we're going to rotate guests and have it on the three different channels. We, we hope it's going to be a lot of fun, you know? It's Suzy Q. I, I don't... Um, I, th I think I have your, your email. Silver Craze Mama, what's going on? All right, so let me put this in for S. Lazinski. Sir Benji, what's going on, my friend? Very cool. Horse throat here, Deborah Walls. That cold and rain got me the other night. Aw, oh, Silver Streak. I hope you feel better soon. Maria Cervantes. Giving the hum look. What's up, Maria? All right, so this is S. Lozinski. Silver Banky. What's going on? All right, guys. So up next is Bub's Delicious. This is her first one. She has two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen. Silver Streak, um, you're welcome. And Silver Craze Mama, yeah, I could use some tea and honey. I've got a little bit of a cough going on. I remember watching the Gong Show. The guy had doing sound effects, including Suzuki, Yamaha, Honda, Kawasaki's back in the 70s and 80s. How cool. <laughs> nice. All right, guys. So for Bub's Alicious, um, I'm not sure what she wants for her silver. So for right now, I'm just going to assume it's a eagle and a kookaburra. And uh, Big Mill, Ida loves free things. Send her whatever you want. Alrighty, we got a 90 percenter for a Benji and a 1982 George Washington. Oh, you get the last George Washington. And this one has some cool toning on it. That's going to Bub's Delicious plus a Benji. It's a very cool. Alright, let's get into these rolls. And uh, let's see here. I enjoyed the face reveal of Victor, LOL. I saw that cruising through the old vids. Yeah, that was a good one. That was our uh, our Chris or, uh, April Fool's joke. Bub's Alicious, yes, there is uh, Boba Fett, Star Wars, or Boba Fett, Vader, and um, Mando. This 71 looks weird. I'm going to put that aside for a second. Coins for amateurs. I'm a I'm a coin jock, you nerd. <laughs> What's going on, Chad? Guys, I, I I tease Chad from from coins for amateurs all the time, because it reminds me of the Saturday Night Live, you know, the Chad. 
Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> but Chad cracks me up. What's the donation limits and how does it work? Josh Voss, there is no limit. Matter of fact, right here, I'm going to take off the sold out sign so you can see exactly what we have. If you can buy as many as you want. Another Boba and a Darth. Okay, that's cool. I'll do that in, this, in just a sec, uh, bubs. So a Boba and a Darth. I got you covered. All right. The Hanging Chad. <laughs> I got you, bubs. Um, so right there, it's a fifty dollars. If you wanted to buy a whole box, it ends up being three fifty. But you get seven ounces of silver, and you get seven pulls out of the Raven Relic bag. Um, so that's what you're guaranteed, and you get quite a quite a bit for your uh, your return on investment. It's always a premium ounce of silver. Uh, to give you an idea, right now the silver is uh, silver eagles. Mandalorians, Boba Fett's, Kookaburras, and Darth Vader's. All premium silver rounds. And uh, I also handle the shipping. So, you know, it, it's not a, not, a, not a bad shake at all. Um, with silver going up too, it's kind of kicking my butt. But yeah, so that's how the tiers work. Um, I do have a $25 tier, but most people would, would rather go the other route because you get a little more for your bang, <clears throat> bang for your buck on the $50. Thank you, Robert Worley. I appreciate it, brother. I love the hoodies. Great prices as well. Oh, thank you, Capital Currency, and thank you for, for getting something like that. That is very, very cool. I appreciate that. Uh, we do have Raven Hot Coins merchandise and the hoodies and stuff. Matter of fact, we I think there's a, a discount code. Hold on just a second. I think we have a discount code going on for Christmas, guys. I just don't know what it is off the top of my head. So I'm trying to see if I can get Miss Raven to uh, let me know. Because that would be cool. Would be cool. Yeah. What's the code for the, the Christmas discount? Christmas. Oh, Christmas. All right, guys. So if you go to the Teespring store and order any of the Ravenhawk coins swag, you get 10% off just for using the code Christmas. Capital Currency, thank you guys. I appreciate you. j Dog says, paging Miss Raymond. Paging Miss Raymond. <laughs> uh, yeah, guys, so Christmas will get you 10% off. Canadian Ryan already ordered his mug. Nice, Rhino. I appreciate that, brother. Guys, Canadian Ryan's one of the most generous people I've ever known. Just a really, 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 really sweet guy. There's a Darth, and I think this is Boba. Matter of fact, guys, we are almost out of the Mandalorians altogether. Holy cow. Bluegrass Silver Seeker Denise, how you doing? Welcome to the show. <coughs> Thank you for coming in and hanging out with us. Matter of fact, we're, uh, we're about maybe 30 minutes from the end of stream giveaway where we're going to have a lot of really good stuff. We have, uh, matter of fact, what's being given away is a Boba Fett, bag of wheats, two quarters, and a 90% Benji. And matter of fact, I need to weigh... <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. Okay, this is strange. Huh. <coughs> I don't know where it disappeared to. I have a knack for losing things on this desk. This desk is huge. Give me just a second, guys.
Alrighty. Ah, there it is. Ha <laughs> ha. I found the scale. I'm going to check this uh, 71 right here because it looks interesting to say the least. Nope. Weighs the right, the right weight. It's just, it's fooling us. Fooling us well. And, uh, holy smokes, guys, 118 likes. Thank you very much, everybody. That is awesome. And, uh, cannot wait to see what happens next. Uh, what else is going on? We got some currency video. Oh, an auction will be coming up in the very near future, guys. Um, it's going to be really, really cool. Oh, and don't forget, we have the Raven Nest Boxes, guys. Um, I need to make a video explaining it better, but for anybody that's been buying any uh, rolls from the channel, if you decide to hold your package in what you know people call a wallet, but I call it the Raven's Nest Box, each week that you hold it, I will pull an item out and add it to your uh your wallet so that'll be like a mercury dime or maybe a proof set or something like that mike pallet what's going on but we are going to uh be doing that matter of fact i'll make a video probably in the next two days or so um because i still have some other videos that I already promised but what that'll do is that pallet or that pallet, that that wallet aka the raven nest actually allows you to build up some stuff and it helps curve a little bit of the cost of shipping for us for some of the people that um you know get something on a weekly basis it's probably a better incentive if you got something every couple weeks or maybe once a month kind of thing it makes a big difference for us guys capital currency with a dollar super sticker thank you brother i appreciate that um big mill I got home. Raven, I got to get. Brother, got to drive home. Right on, bro. Take care. Robert Rorley, did you start my nest? Uh, Robert, you know what? If you want to be in it, I can I can add you on there. No problem. And uh, matter of fact, we got to get that taken care of. Nice. Eating dinner with the wifey, says Mike. Cool. Uh, but yeah, so when you're interested, I'll sign you up. Um, I think Bub's delicious, and a couple of other people have already done it. And uh, CM Silver and whatnot. I just need to go and get the boxes so I can show you guys. So we're going to make a video. And Miss Raven's actually going to be adding artwork to the boxes as time goes on. She'll add a little something to each box for the different people that have them. And then, so over time, if you eventually say, hey, I want to have my box, uh, we'll send it to you, and we'll we'll get you a new nest, you know. Um, so I think that's kind of a cool idea. <clears throat> Man, I am dropping half dollars everywhere, guys. I don't know what's going on with me tonight. My brain's all over the place. All righty. Yes, I was going to say, if you have, definitely do. Nice. Guys, Colorado Coin Hunting with a $10 Super Chat. Just something to help with shipping, brother. Merry Christmas. Thank you, bro. <coughs> <coughs> I appreciate that. Capital Currency got himself a, beer, a deer back from the butcher. Oh, man. I'm jealous. I'm very jealous. Alrighty. Maria Cervantes, you're missing the industry giveaway. I know you I know you like the giveaways. Jeremy B, Zach Lucas, what's going on guys? Good to see Zach and Lucas and Jeremy in the house. And uh Yeah. Give me just a second, guys. I gotta do something real fast.
let's see. Alrighty. Whew, so that is for Bubs Alicious, guys. <clears throat> Bubs, I'm sorry we didn't get you any silver or anything out of there. It bums me out. I want to get us some silver. And this cough is killing me. I don't know what is going on. Alright, so there we go. Bing. Bing. And bing. I am on the list for the jerky. Well, thank you, bro. Moose 2K20. Yes, the end of stream is going to be nuts, man. All right, so this is Bubs. And I believe Bubs also has a nest. <coughs> the nests are going to be really, really cool. All right, so up next, guys, is Colorado Coin. We have two, four, six, seven... Get a pull out of the relic bag. It's a 1969 set. You're welcome, Bubs Alicious, my friend. And uh, coin, Colorado coin, brother. Which uh, which silver would you like, my friend? Boba Fett. All right. I will get you one here in just a second. You're more than welcome, brother. The Boba Fett. I love the Boba Fett rounds, actually, or the Boba Fett coin. I think that they did really good in the amount of detail that they did. And I was actually shocked that a country got the, the rights to be able to produce anything Star Wars. Um, I couldn't imagine what the royalties would be. Because you know Lucas Films and, and all that, they get they, they knew what they were doing when it came to uh, marketing, you know. Bluegrass Silver Seeker, it's getting a little better all the time. All right, so there's the Boba Fett. Let's get to the next roll. I am really bummed about this silver not being in the boxes so far, guys. Um, I was saying that earlier I'd seen this picture saying, you know, hey, that this box was pre-sorted, and it's from a different state. I think the state was Oregon, but if they start doing that, if they start pre-doing pre it, we're all going to have to change. Aaron Wilkerson says that's a sweet bar. Thank you, bro. Um, we're all going to have to change our system probably to go to, like, the JW system. And that'll be having our own rolls in boxes and, you know, adding stuff if they start pre-sifting all the silver out, you know. Nothing in the boxes at all, bubs. We haven't even had an NIFC tonight, which really is kind of mind-blowing, to be honest. Hey, Silver Shark, how you doing? Yep, that is true, Robert. All Disney. That's why also the marketing of Disney toys and stuff and products has gone gangbusters. I mean, there's a Disney... There's Disney everything. Disney toothpaste, soap, cereal, toothbrushes. I mean, just everything, you know? Yeah, bubs, I am, I am very shocked because normally we do. We normally get a nice little run of... Uh, NIFCs or maybe some proofs, but tonight there's been absolutely not one single extra coin in here, but you know how we do it. If we get skunked on this box, I'll add something to the end of stream just because I like, I like doing that kind of stuff. I like giving stuff away, guys. It's fun. Alrighty. Whoo, AG47 Recon. What's going on, my friend? Hope you're having a good evening. Thanks for being in the show. Guys, I can tell I'm, I've got something going on. <clears throat> I've, I've had a little bit of a cough for a little while, and I'm hoping it goes away soon. It's kind of irritating.
Let me just sec it. <clears throat> I'm sorry about this, guys. Somebody uh, doing something here. All right, so we're going to get back into it. Last roll. Sorry about that. Ooh, fried shrimp. You cannot go wrong. Des Logic, do we walk Peppa? Yes, uh, we walk Peppa all the time, actually. I circ, man, we have not found anything this evening. Matter of fact, I was about to say, uh, you know, or I said a minute ago, if we get skunked on this box, I'm going to add something to the end of stream as well because it is a very big bummer to not get something out of the box. All right, that was Colorado coin hunting, guys. <clears throat> Thank you, Colorado. I really do appreciate it. Uh... She gets a, right now we're using a, a, a regular harness, a body one, but I like the one that's actually called a halty. It uses the nose and it doesn't put pressure, it just takes the dog's direction and, and that's the easiest way to control them. Uh, Bruce Doc Smith, we'll probably be on about another 20 minutes, give or take. And this is Colorado. Hunter. All right, next one up is uh, Bubs Alicious. Bubs Alicious has a fifty dollars spot. Yes, we did find the guitar pick. That is true. That is our our only find tonight is the guitar pick. <laughs> All right, so two, four, six, seven. Would you pay $90 for a quarter roll with a tall grass peri ender showing and another one showing the reverse on the other end of the roll? Moose, K, Moose 2K20, you're taking a gamble. If it's loaded with Ws, then yeah, you're making a bunch. Uh, Bubs Alicious wants a Mando. Sure. Matter of fact, the Mandos, there's only like four left. After this, yep, the Mandos are running low. And then we're going to be getting new new silver designs in. I'm not sure what yet, but but I'm going to get a, a nice little variety. Yeah, use the Halties. Yes, Savvy Stacker, it is. Halties are awesome. And so I want to get, get her a Halty when she gets a little bit bigger. Um, because, like Savvy Stacker said, they work very well. Um, Bub's got a quarter out that pool, but you know what, Bub's, <clears throat> I'm going to bump you to the Benji just because. But yeah, guys, if you do not know what a halty is, you definitely got to check it out, guys. Um, it, it is, you use so little effort to walk your dog, um, <clears throat> and it looks kind of, people confuse it for a muzzle. But it's really not a muzzle. It's just a strap that goes around the head and around the nose. And it makes a really big difference. <clears throat> uh, you're welcome, Bubs. You're welcome. Um, it makes a big difference in being able to control really big dogs with literally two fingers. You know, you don't have to do anything that's, uh, that's too out of hand. So the relics are used for the giveaways, um, but my giveaways only cost 25 total relics. And while you're sitting here and hanging out and enjoying the show, you get to get you get to build up those relics and play the games, the dice games and stuff like that. I wish that I could have gotten one for my pit mix. Yeah, Wolfie. <clears throat> I'm telling you, they're really cool.
125 likes. Thank you, everybody, for the love. That is awesome, guys. Cannot thank everyone enough for all the support. We got some really cool stuff coming on in the near future, guys. Like I said, we have the Ida Herring Cancer Quilt uh, going on. You got Paula Bloom with the uh, Q&A, Coin Q&A on Monday nights. As well as, uh, then you have myself, Rob, and Seeker doing a every other Monday night one-hour show. Matter of fact, those shows that we're doing um, for the interviews with people, they're only going to be about an hour long, give or take. It's going to be really cool. Yes, Bubs Alicious, they are gentle, gentle leads, is a halty. And, um... If I'm not explaining the games and stuff good enough, guys, um, just uh, let me know, and we'll, we'll try to explain a little bit better. But I think if you kind of watch how people play the games, it gives you an idea <clears throat> of you know what you can do. Michael Ellis, 45 acres. All he needs to do is whistle. Nice. That's a cool way to have your animals. You know, when they just have freedom. That's some, that's really cool. I want to have a, some property one day. I'd like to have a property where I could have, like, a couple ponds, you know, um, and raise some sheep and stuff like that, some goats. Be a little bit more self-sufficient, you know? And uh, what else was there? There's something else, guys. My, I'm, nope, that's a cop. You know what? It never hurts to to double check stuff. So here's a seventy one that looks really silverish. You know. Nope, still the right weight. That's a bummer deal. Darth Plata. Hey, guys, if you're watching, um, if you're somebody that goes and hangs out on Twitch, check out Darth Plata, a.k.a. the Hydroconomist. It'll be cool. But uh, Darth Plot is on, on uh, Twitch, guys. He does a Thursday night uh, show as well. He should be on here in the very near future, I think, in the next hour. Brick in the house. What's going on, Brick? Brick didn't get... You didn't get... Aw, oh, man. I hate when people don't get the notification. That's a bummer. But hey, Brick, I'm glad you're here, bro. Thanks for coming in. All right. So this one is uh, Bubs Alicious. Bubs, I'm sorry again. We didn't get extra. Um, next up is Shark Bait. Ooh, ha, ha. All right, so this is Bubs. <clears throat> and it's been happening to some really big channels, too. Excuse me, guys, one second. I need to sneeze. All right, I didn't want to do that into the microphone. That would have not been fun. So Shark Beat is up next. Two, four, six, seven. And if you guys did not know, Shark Bait was initiated at Mount Wanahakalugi. <laughs> ah, Brick was in a meeting. Nice. Boom. We got a 90%er a Benji. For the pull, where is the Benji's? There they are. And uh, Shark Bait, let me know what you want for your silver, my friend. Uh, you get yourself a choice of either a Silver Eagle, a Kookaburra, 
a Mandalorian, a Darth Vader, or a Boba Fett. And, but let me know, and I will definitely take care of it. Mandalorian, Boba Fett, or uh, Darth Vader. Those are the three choices. You get one of, one of the three. See, I don't like when they do that, when they're messing with subs. If you're sub to somebody, you know, that's not cool. That they take you away just because maybe you haven't watched them in a little while. But really, they should just leave that alone, you know. <laughs> Cody. <laughs> That's funny. Alright, so I'm waiting to see what they say. Yeah, Darth Plata is hard to go wrong with the Mandos. That's for sure. I'm waiting to see what Sharkbait says here. <clears throat> yep, Cody, they should. They should leave it alone. Pulling your to your videos down. Wow, that's not cool. <laughs> Darth Plata, you know, I was talking to somebody the other day, and I said it makes it seem like we have to relearn the system about once every seven months, you know? It's like you just get used to it. You're like, okay, this is cool. Let's let's go with this. I like the new interface. And then they change it all around and say, well, we're improving it, you know. Uh, capital currency, that's a bummer, man. Shark bait, just a minute. I'm trying to figure out which one my son would like the most without ruining the surprise. Ah. Hey, you know what, shark bait? If you need some time to think about it, just email me. Um, and uh, we'll do it that way because this won't get mailed out until like Tuesday or Wednesday of next week. And uh, yeah, I, yeah, I love currency. If you guys are giving away stuff, let me know. Or not giving away. If you're getting rid of currency guys you're trying to sell it let me know what it is i i always like taking a look and seeing you know what's going on yeah shark bait no worries what i'll do is i'll just put your name on the thing and you 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 pick whichever one you want and that'll make it so you can easily uh you know um make it a surprise you know you can kind of ask without it seeming very obvious Benjamin Browning, am I interested in Chuck E. Cheese tokens? Well, we have a Chuck E. Cheese just down the street from the house. Once COVID goes down, I could go over there and play. <laughs> go go get some, some uh, tickets for, for the tokens. I, li I like Chuck E. Cheese. $19.23, $2 silver certificate. Nice, Moose. That's way cool. All right, this is the last roll for shark bait. Ooh, ha, ha. Um, now I have to go watch Finding Nemo. It's all your, all your fart, <laughs> all your fault, shark bait. <laughs> I can't believe I just said all your fart. Oh my gosh, I'm probably gonna be selling some stuff off some stuff. Well, Capital Currency, email me. Uh, Email me with what you got, and I'll, I'll see what I can do. Ooh, ha, ha. Welcome to Mount Wanahakalugi. No, there's a uh, there's a there's a Chuck E. Cheese literally right down the street from my house, J Dog. <laughs> yes, all your fart. <laughs> oh man, shark bait. Ooh. <laughs> Harrison Zanto Reed, how you doing? Do I like what? I don't I don't understand, Harrison. What do you mean? If 
fact, I'm going to put this here, shark bait, so I don't forget it. It's going to be right in front of me. All right, guys. Last one up is Hey Zeus 2. Four. Six. Oh, Bruce Willis. Yeah, Bruce Willis is hilarious. I think he's pretty cool. Desk logic, it would cost a lot more than fifty bucks to get uh to get Peppa. Two, four, six, seven. I'm gonna let him have the last roll. Hey Zeus, getting a pull out of the bag. What you talking about, Willis? You know what? It's his first time we're gonna re-pull. What the heck? You know what? I'm just gonna be nice. We're going to give you the 69S proof, my brother. Oh, starting bid. <laughs> Who says I want to sell them, Des Logic? She's a good dog. And then, uh, hey, Zeus, let me know what you want for your silver, brother. For now, I'm going to assume it might be a kookaburra, but I don't know. But uh, if, hey, Zeus, if you're still in the room, let me know. And I will grab you the... Uh, the one that you want. You're definitely welcome, Zeus. No problem, brother. <clears throat> so I see him there. I just now I need exactly Jesse. Peppa equals priceless. <laughs> I have a 1934 hundred dollar bill listed on sale on Discord. If you want to, look. Deborah, just send me an email. A hundred and twenty six likes. Thank you, Gringo. I appreciate that. I assume correctly. Nice. Ha <laughs> ha. That's awesome. I got lucky. Judy is cuckoo for kookaburras, no doubt. I mean, and I'm not. You know, I don't have super deep pockets, guys. You know, if I if I see something I like and I can afford it. I'll buy it, so I'm not promising that I will get the stuff, but I definitely want to take a look, you know, and, and if I can afford it and it and it's reasonable to both of us, then yeah, I don't mind helping out people at all, um, you know, we all want to try to get rid of stuff from time to time when we can, and we want to get a decent price for it, you know. <laughs> Susie Q got a dog for her husband. It was a good trade. <laughs> yeah, this person here is... Uh... Thank you, Susie Q. Thank you guys for getting on the, the comments here. And uh, Harrison Zanto, I don't know what that means at all. I trade my husband for a dog, says Jesse O. <laughs> oh man, that's funny. Uh, I wonder. I wonder what Miss Raven would trade me for. Probably, probably a bucket of nickels. She's like, I'll trade you for for a hundred dollars. <laughs> oh man, you know. Here's the thing, guys. You can't get wrong. You can't stay mad at the trolls, you know? Uh, you really can't. A knocks of halves. <laughs> oh, man. I'm delirious. I'm really... Part of me is really upset right now, guys, because I wanted these boxes to be filled with silver. And they're not. And so now I'm having to try to figure out what are we going to do for the end of stream. You know, we got a lot of cool stuff, but uh, thank you, Peter Bowes. Because of RFT on Monday, I threw down 50. I'll be keeping up with you. Awesome channel. Thank you, Josh. I appreciate that, brother. You're an awesome man. And uh, we're every, Josh, we're on Sundays and Thursdays. Thursday night, 6 p.m. Sundays, 5 p.m. 
<laughs> Cody's wife said she'd pay us to take him and she would send food. <laughs> Benjamin Browning, I should eat a whole raw egg to be cool and entertaining. Yeah. I'm not the LA beast. I could eat a I could eat a raw egg. That's not hard. I used to do it for football back in the day. All right, guys, last roll, and it looks like we got skunked on the entire night. Man, not even an NIFC to be found. That is truly, truly disappointing. So what are we going to do, guys? What are we going to do? Let me get this for Jesus out of the way. And then we'll go from there. Benjamin Browning, I love LA Beast too. That's why instead of uh, saying have a good day, I say have a great day. Because you know how he is. He goes, have a good day. Like that. Um, I can could do his voice pretty well, actually. <laughs> have a good day. But I do the have a great day as a nod of respect to the gentleman. I didn't want to steal his thing, but I wanted to do something to say that I was a fan. And some people catch it and some people don't. All right, so what are we going to add to the end of stream? What are we going to do? Give me just a second, guys. I will be right back. Give me one sec. <laughs> Peppa giving away for the skunk box. <laughs> Deslogic's trying hard to get that dog, guys. Look out. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, Moose, I wish I had gold, but I'm sorry. I can't do gold. I'm going to do two things. We're going to give away a Silver Proof 2007S Idaho State Quarter. So that's a silver quarter. That's going to be added to the end of stream. Plus a 1938 Canadian penny. Check this out, guys. This thing is cool. A 1938 Canadian penny. A lot of people don't have the older Canadian coin, you know, pennies and stuff. So that's going to be added to the mix, guys. So what we got is we have a silver proof quarter, Canadian penny, a Benji. Actually, you have a dollar in face uh, constitutional silver, a Boba Fett, and a bag of Wheaties, a Ravenhawk triple trifecta of stickers. And if you didn't hear earlier, guys, our Teespring account for merchandise, if you use the code CHRISTMAS, you will save 10% on your purchase and thank you again all right guys so this is going to be a really quick giveaway there's only going to be a three minute timer only three minutes let me set this up real quick and this is eos all right like i said three minutes everybody good luck to you and a big thank you again to everybody that donated. Mark B., Aaron Brenneman, Chris Nab, Kevin Nolan, happy birthday from his daughter Megan, Chief Stacker, S. Lazinski, Bubs Delicious Twice, Colorado Coin Hunting, Shark Bait, Lucky, ooh ha ha, and Hey Zeus, thank you very, very much. And then a big thank you to all the Raven Nation members, my first member ever, Vicky C., then it's NCFX, STI, JW, Coins, and Hobby, CM Silver, uh, Canadian Ryan, Papa K, yes, Papa Cryptos, Bill Gibson, Big Mill, Badlands 44, Xanner, Jason 43, Nickel Nation, Arrow Coins, Rob Finds Treasure, Betty Jane, Mustang Dave, Frank Rush, Hillbilly, Scott Jarvie, Jeff S&G, Ching Seeker, Jack Stack Silver, Pro Slice, 
56. It's Susie Q, 96. William Shea, Louis Taylor, Tim Eisman, Gringo, OG, 22. Bubs Delicious, Roy Hathaway, Caribbean Coins, I-90 Coins, Weave Man, 77, Mickey Robs Banks, Old White Guy, Brass Junkie, Retro Robbie, Ty Hitman, Gary Henderson, William Fowler, Sergeant Stacker, Josh Schultz, Super Jaw, 29, Michelle Iberola, Aaron the Collector, Catman Duism, Penny Dog, Dr. Days, Laughing Rooster, Silver Bowl 30, Robert Rowley, <coughs> excuse me guys, Silver Seeker, Peggy Hunts, everything, Mr. Mark Mello. What's up, Inkman78? Good to see you, bro. Clay37, John Scott, Rose Dragon Coins, VC Coins Nevada, Full Push Metals, Sparker Flair, Ali Savvy Stacker, Moose 2K20, Bills Coins and Treasures, Silver Soldier of Fortune, Military Coins, Keith Andres, Swagalicious, Jeff Brown, Silver Hair Seeker, Michael Ellis, Allison Silverland, Capital Currency, and Plumber Stacker. <laughs> Whoo! Get to 150 likes before we leave, says Jesse. Jesse, I'm happy with what we got there, you know, and I'm very, very appreciative to everybody that is part of this channel. A hundred people in the stream right now hanging out. Happy Bears! What's going on, my friend? Bricket fan says, I hope to get some memberships after the new year. Nice. No worries, man. All right, so we got 20 seconds to the end of the giveaway here, and we're going to count that off in just a couple seconds with a big whopping 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. And the winner is, boom, Bill Gibson, ladies and gentlemen. Holy cow. I don't remember the last time Bill Gibson's won an industry giveaway. And if anybody's deserving, guys, Bill has done a lot of stuff for my channel over over the the over the time, the life of the channel. Um wow, very cool. Guys, a big thank you to all the moderators. I can't do this without you. You guys are freaking awesome people. And you guys know that when I'm able to, I hook you up with, uh, you know, the moderator appreciation nights. And I just got a lot of love for everybody. You guys are really, really cool. So Bill Gibson, brother, congratulations, man. I do, I do not know. Bill, is this your first win ever? Or like this, maybe it's your second win. I know that Bill hasn't won very often, that's for sure. Um, unreal, guys. Bluegrass Silver Seeker Denise, thank you very much. You are awesome for being here. And Des Logic, are you kidding? Okay, Des Logic, here it is. Here's a sticker right here. Boom, boom. And I'm gonna have a talk with Miss Raven because I asked her multiple times to send that to you. All right, so I'm going to put this in here. What's up, Capital Currency, with a $2 super sticker. And uh, it has your name on it, Desk Logic. So now this is going in the box to be for sure. This has stickers with your name. If she doesn't get it to you, then there's something really wrong going on, man. I'm really sorry that that happened, bro. You know that I like making sure people are happy and taken care of. <laughs> All right, bro. Well, we'll we'll get you taken care of. It's just an honest mistake, you know. All right, guys. J Dog, Silver Streak, Canadian Riding, Sergeant Stacker, Rose Dragon Coins, Imperial Label, uh, Jesse O, Pro Slice Fifty Six, Gringo. J Dog, Peter Bowes, Canadian Ryan, Susie Q, Robert Worley, CM Silver, all the awesome mods, Brass Junkie, my brother. You guys are amazing. I love you to death, and we'll see you in the very, very near future. Chris Nab, thank you, brother. And uh, like always, please make sure to take care of one another. Ravenhawk Coins.
Have a great day.